you're going to be so surprised how science and technology really began because of Christianity and Jesus Christ. That's right. It totally impacted science and technology because God exists. He's the one that created the universe. As a matter of fact, check out how Christianity and Jesus impacted science and technology. Check it out. Be sure to subscribe and press alert to get new notifications of new success secrets made available on VFN TV. The Business Mountain has done so much. I even think about you know, how science and education, how it financed the whole study of what's going on in the area technology of technology today. Yeah, because, because we understand there's a creator. He created everything. And so then it can actually be understood mm. because it, you first have to acknowledge he exists and he rewards those who diligently, diligently seek him. But he also talks about that, that in that you begin to learn from him. In Romans 1.28, he talks about everything was created by him. And the fact that men are without excuse when you observed his qualities, his awesome qualities and what he created. Well, that's where the business mountain came in in regards to science and education. Check it out. It's hard to imagine life without the technological advances of modern science. Science, as we know it today, emerged hundreds of years ago during a period of unprecedented advances in mathematics, physics, astronomy, biology, and chemistry. The vast majority of these brilliant scientists, nearly every single one of them, were Christians. They believe that since the universe was created by a rational creator using rational rules, it ought to yield its secrets to rational creatures using reason and observation. As a result, these early scientists searched for natural laws, confident that they existed, and they found them. Isn't that exciting when you're looking at what, you know, Christianity has done to science and education and, yeah. and the business mountain. And it's just so important. And it's amazing how so many people want to pull God in it. Of all the things, evolution, we come from monkeys. You know, we're creating the image and the likeness of God, That's right. you know, in his image. And so it's, it's, it's you're seeing people just want to do away with God. But understand, every time you do away with God, that's when oppression comes in, that's when slavery comes in, that's when you know men's religions come in. Look at the nations of the world. It's yes. called the clue. I mean, it's, you can see it. Be sure to subscribe and press alert to get new notifications of new success secrets made available on VFN TV. You know, a lot of people want to abide with the Lord, but they just don't have a plan to do it. You can request that plan today at iabide.org. I'm your host, Greg Lancaster, and we're so glad that you joined us. Don't forget you can join us 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Download our app and sign up for our newsletter, The Torch, at vfntv.com. I've enjoyed our time together. God bless.